Tonight, reaction to the abrupt resignation of Chico City Council member Scott Huber from the group he says drove him to resign. Action News Now reporter Carmela Karcher joins us now with the latest on today's upheaval in Chico City government. Carmela, what did you learn? Alan, this started less than a week ago when Huber says the group Citizens for a Safe Chico began a harassment campaign after he took a summer job in Wyoming. Councilmember Scott Huber announced in a letter Monday that he is resigning from the Chico City Council effective immediately. It follows his resignation from his Wyoming job last week after Huber says his employer was being targeted by paid ads like this one from Citizens for a Safe Chico for employing him. In his resignation letter, Huber said in part, no one should be forced to choose between family and community, but that is precisely the situation that I've been placed in. My livelihood in the form of a seasonal job that I relied upon to support my loved ones has been sabotaged. There, we never encouraged anybody or asked them to call his employer. Terry DuBose is the president of the Political Action Committee. She says Citizens for a Safe Chico asked supporters to contact Huber, asking him to resign from council. And we completely disapprove with anybody that did that. That is just... Uh, not behavior that we condone. DuBose went on to say that regardless, a member on city council should be present, especially with big decisions coming up. I believe that, you know, the person that's sitting on our city council should be living in our city and um, that he would not be representing us well, um, just physically and mentally here you know, to get us through some of the hardest times. But this news of resignation came as a shock to some on council, including Mayor Andrew Coolidge, who didn't know about it until I called him Monday afternoon. Honestly, I'm a little bit surprised by the news. It wasn't something that I was expecting. I've worked with Scott pretty closely over the last, you know, six months. Um, it wasn't something that I thought would occur. Council member Alex Brown also reacted, posting on Instagram saying she condemns these actions wholeheartedly and asks fellow council members to do the same. I did reach out to Scott Huber and I'm still waiting to hear back. To read the full Facebook post from Citizens for Safe Chico, Huber's resignation letter and the paid ad, we have it all posted on our website at actionnewsnow.com. Alan? Thanks, Carmela.